so yesterday I applied this red tough toe to this old shoe and I knew I was going to get a bad spot and that's what uh, we're talking about today. So right here it didn't cure and I know it wasn't going to cure. That's my first squirt because I didn't equalize the cartridge. Generally, when there's an issue with a non-cure, 99.999% of the time, the cartridge wasn't equalized. Well, first of all, the, why you need to equalize the cartridge is because when we fill these, sometimes there's more material in one side than the other. And you can see here that with the red, it's more full than the clear curative side. So we have to remove the cap and dispense material to equalize. You see how the red came out? And now the clear will come out. Then we apply the mixer tip, equalize the cartridge again, dispense a one to two inch line. Now we're ready to go. I know that right here, that area didn't set up. Didn't cure. So, what I want to do is remove anything that is not fully cure. You can cut it out too if you need to. Then I'm going to sand the area. And reapply. Equalizing the cartridge. Tufto will bond very well to itself and blend into itself. So we're just going to patch that up. Now I know that the, that's been equalized and it's going to set up and cure. Rotate the shoe for a minute and that will blend in very well to itself. Generally, it's because it wasn't equalized. If you equalize it out of the gate, you shouldn't have any problems. And if you're not using our handy dandy gun, which I highly recommend if you're gonna do more than one or two of these a year, but if you're doing it by hand, sometimes instead of depressing on the middle of the uh, plunger, you'll start depressing on one side. Be sure to make sure you depress even pressure on the center of the plunger. And if you set the plunger, or the cartridge down, pick it back up either always using it with label up or always using it with label down. Reapply, it blends in very well to itself. So that's how you fix a non-cured or soft spot on your shoe.